a Dread Fun original production. Please sit back and enjoy. Guys, Dread Fun here with another one of my time lapse video uploads. Uh, recently got a love from a lot of love from the fitness bodybuilding community here on YouTube. Uh, not that there's much of a bodybuilding art community anywhere. I guess it's just me. But uh, yeah, with Nick Strength and Power featuring me on one of his channels there, I got a nice upload. So this is a, a drawing that I wanted to do. And uh, Eugene Sandow is the man that uh, started it all. I mean, if you lift a weight or do any type of uh, resistance training or any type of, you know, uh, core type work, if you work with dumbbells, if you work with uh, Indian clubs or pretty much anything, calisthenics, you name it, it all started with Eugene Sandow. Uh, so famous and so legendary, he is that statue that uh, the Mr. Olympians win every year. They get to hold it up and uh, that's him. So I found this image. Uh, it's a classic shot of him in some, I guess they're like some Greek sandals. And he's sort of, you know, holding himself in a in a powerful position. And right off the bat, you're going to notice that uh, not as large as our modern day bodybuilders. This was a, a pure, aesthetic, powerful man. He was also a strength competitor, not just, a, well, I guess not even a strength competitor. I mean, this predates competition. He was a strong man uh, going town to town, doing feats of strength for people, as well as displaying his physique. And then uh, him writing about it and, for, and, and developing what became bodybuilding afterwards led to, you know, you know Dread Fun doing a video about him 150 years later. I don't know if it's that long. I didn't write anything down. Mm -hmm. So this one's tough because uh, I use an 8.5 by 11 inch page. And it doesn't give me a lot of room. And when I'm doing these full body shots, it's tough because you're only fitting like that much in the face. And it can all be made or, or, or broken just in the face. So luckily this was a, a shot of Eugen with uh, it's kind of shaded. Uh, so really I just I just had to get the one side down and then darken it all up and then focus a lot on the musculature and what I was going to put in and what I was going to take out with the, the graphite. And in the end what I was hoping to do is, you know, I wanted it to be realistic but also to look kind of what Eugen uh, was attempting, to look like those uh, those ideal Greek statues that you see. Uh, and the white marble, uh, you know, their obliques and their and intercostals and everything all develop. Everything is symmetrical. You don't have, you know, a 25-inch arm with 17-inch calves. You know, everything matches and it's very proportional. So this was a, a great drawing for me to do and a, a lot of fun researching. Hope you guys like this. Don't forget to subscribe and share the video around. Dread Fun out. This has been a DreadFun.com production. Thanks for watching.